so in base to that tip dot js file type button came dot click and in this click we will have a function and in this function we will have if condition and in this if condition parenthesis we will have dollar this dot has class and we will check for that icon class copy that class and paste it here and let it also also now let's check for that mute camera icon now let's copy this class here i will add dollar this dot add a class and to this add a class we will pass this icon name in string form then copy that and paste it and change that add a class to remove class and from that button came we will remove this class and copy this and paste it in else condition but in else condition it will be reversed in else condition we will change that mute camera icon to unmute camera icon so cut this and paste it here also cut this and paste this in add class now back to that index.html file remove this and our toggling for camera is now working now let's copy this and paste it here and add a command here toggle microphone and also add a command here toggle join and leave here in that here in that toggle microphone you will change its classes so back to that index.html file and here search for that mute microphone icon copy this class back to script.js file select that class and will replace it and also copy that unmute microphone class back to that script file select that and paste it here now back to that index.html and let's remove that and it's not working refresh it still not working and let's change that button came to button mic so now it's working now let's do it for plug change it to button plug and for that come here and i will search for close icon i will add that window close icon so copy this icon class select this class and paste it here back to that index.html file copy that plug icon class back to script.js file and paste it here now let's remove that close window icon and now the plug icon is toggling successfully now back to that script.js file copy this remove this and let's paste it here And here you will type RTC client dot leave. So when we press that we close window icon, the user should leave the channel. Now let's refresh it. Click on that icon, and we will per get permission to that user camera and microphone. And joining the channel will be successful. And now if I click on that close window icon, we will leave that channel. And we have leave the channel successfully. But that user camera and microphone will not be muted as we have not set functionality for it. So let's set functionality for it. So let's type constant stop video. It will be equal to asynchronous anonymous function. Type RDC dot local video set dot close. Then copy it and paste it and change it close to stop. Below that, type RTC dot client dot unpublish, and to that unpublish, we will pass RTC dot local video track. And here in else, below that RTC client dot leave, we will add that stop video. Now let's try. Click on that plug icon. Allow it. Allow it. Now, if we click on that close window icon, we will leave the channel successfully and our local video track will be stopped and removed.
Now let's add a function for stop microphone. So type com stop audio and it will be error function and type rtc dot local audio straight dot close copy this and paste change that close to stop and below type rtc dot client dot unpublish and to unpublish we will pass rtc dot local audio track so here in else we will also add a stop audio function now let's try click on that plug icon allow that and now if I click on that close icon we will leave the channel and our local video track and audio track will be removed now let's copy that and paste it change that remove class to CSF and to that CSF we will pass the property and its value so in quotation type color set the color to red we will move this to if condition so cut it from here and paste it here paste it here and change it to black let's paste it here and here change it to black add it here and here and change it to black now with toggling the icon color will be changed to black and red so in button came if condition we will add here stop video and in else condition we will add start video also here in button mic also in button mic if condition we will add stop audio and in else condition we will add start audio so back to the browser now if we click on that plug icon our icon will be changed to close window icon and the color will be changed from black to red and our local screen will appear now if we click on that microphone icon we can toggle that now let's check the whole functionality in the first step we will click on that plug icon and we will join the local screen and the icon color will be changed in second step now let's click on that plug icon the icon color will be changed and our local theme and remote theme will appear now in third step if we click on that plug icon our icon color will be changed we will get permission to that user camera and microphone and we will get a message this red room is full and that background color will be changed and now if we click on that close window icon we will leave that channel now if we click again on that plug icon we will be unable to join the channel as the room is already full so we have successfully built the Gora one to one video call web app so in so in our upcoming modules we will build the Gora manage menu video call one to many video call and real time messaging screen sharing and agora cloud recording